Let's look at the module 8 study guide, problems 1 and 2. A figure shows a scale drawing of a room. Uh, each square stands for one square foot. What is the area of the room in square feet? Okay, so we just need to find some of the dimensions here. So how far across does this go? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So this is 14 across. How far up? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 up. And then we have this little part here that is 4 across and 3 down. So let's find these two areas. This is a composite shape. So let's just cut it into two shapes. So the area here, area equals length times width. And then area equals 14 times 6. And 14 times 6. So the area there is 84. So this, area, this has an area of 84. Um, and this is square feet. And then what's the area of this portion? Area equals length times width so area equals 4 times 3 area equals 12 so this is 12 square feet so 12 square feet and 84 square feet we want the area of the whole room so we take this area and add this area so 84 plus 12 and we get 96 square feet 1 is C. On to 2. Now let the figure show a scale drawing of a park with the largest dimension equal to 63 meters. What is the scale? What's the scale? So here's 14, but it's actually 63. So 14 units represents 63 three meters. Now if we look at our answer options, all of these means all of these show that we're talking about one unit. So how do we get this to one? We have to divide by 14. And if we divide by 14 on the top, we have to divide by 14 on the bottom, which leaves us with one unit over and 63 divided by 14 is 4.5 meters. So the answer to 2 is 1 unit is 4.5 meters. The answer to 2 is B.